The ocean covers 70% of our planet and provides 97% of the Earth's water. And because of this, it is no surprise that the ocean is home to more than 230,000 different species of life. The amount of biodiversity in our waters is phenomenal. However, these species are being put at risk due to rapid changes. And what is the initial cause? Climate change. In taking over our planet's land, we put a lot of extra carbon and methane into our atmosphere. Problems have given rise as a result of this. Oceans are projected to experience continued increase in sea surface temperatures, sea level rise, and ocean acidification. High surface temperature change can not only affect breeding for marine species, but can determine the number of male or female offspring. The salmon species, in particular, is likely to be affected by changes in temperature and salinity of ocean waters. The increase in temperatures may cause a decline in salmon survival. The salinity of waters could directly affect salmon via lower growth rates and reduce anti-predator response. This decline in salmon, among other species, will start disturbances in food chains and marine ecosystems. Due to the excess carbon and other greenhouse gases we pumped in the atmosphere, more of the sunlight's heat has been trapped in the atmosphere, but most of it hasn't stayed there. Since 1955, 90% of the Earth's excess heat has been absorbed by the ocean and soaked up half of the Earth's CO2 emissions since the Industrial Revolution. This CO2 gets chemically transformed into acid. Oceanic acidification harms estuary and species, specifically shellfish and other organisms that form carbon-based shells. These organisms will find it difficult to form their shells, which may even start to dissolve. This can also affect fish and other gill marine animals since they will find it harder to extract the needed dissolved oxygen required for them to breathe. Ocean acidification is also causing a stress response in coral known as coral bleaching. The coral mortality rate has reached up to 70% in some regions, which is a big effect on ecosystems since it is home to over 25% of marine life. Climate change due to greenhouse gases and heat being trapped in the atmosphere, also known as global warming, has caused species to distribute differently. This change of climate affects the marine environments and thus the organisms that live there. Plants and animals that are suited to cooler climates will need to move polewards or uphill when the climate becomes even just a little warmer. The penguin species in the Antarctic Peninsula region have become a victim to the location change of their habitat. Global warming could contribute to the mass extinction of many wild animals in the near future, including polar bears, sea turtles, North Atlantic right whales, and Australian frogs. These animals are considered to be the silent witness of the rapid changes being inflicted on the earth. From the air we breathe to the water within us, all of our lives are still connected to the ocean. Helping our oceans will help us all. That way, when visiting the nearest beach, while looking for sea life, there will still be life to see.